question is, when staring at your big goal and it seems like a massive elephant that you can't conquer, what will you do? Well, that's the question. And this podcast, Eat Your Elephant, is here to help you to find the answer that will keep you moving forward and making progress. Because you can eat your elephant one bite at a time. I'm your host, Nick Macy, and let's dive right in. Well, hello there. Glad you're here and and joining in 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 the Eat Your Elephant podcast. Ready to take action towards your goals? Excellent. I say, this month, I'm doing something. I'm asking and and begging and needing uh, your feedback. What what's the, your challenge? What's your number one biggest challenge that's holding you back from achieving your goals or making the progress that you want to make? I try to put out material in this podcast to help you to make the progress that you want and you want to achieve your goals. But really, the most valuable thing that, to, that would help me be able to do that better is a little bit of feedback and info from you. So please let me know. Go to nickmazy.com slash survey and tell me what your big challenge is. You can do it anonymously. You don't have to give me you know, personal information, but it'll be a big help. I really appreciate it. And it'll help me improve the podcast and get to know you a little bit better too. I really appreciate you uh, doing that and giving me just a little bit of information. So thank you. And today, well, what are we talking about today? Today we're talking about a, a very, very important thing. Well, like a lot of things, but you know, it's very important. If you're achieving your goals it, and maybe just important for your entire life. Now, I'm going to go ahead and let you know, I'm not a genius, uh, so uh, I'm not the first person to say this. I uh, won't be the last, and you may have heard it before, but still listen. The main takeaway, I'm going to go ahead and give it to you right up front. The main takeaway for this, the rest of this episode is don't give up on you. Don't give up on you. You know, that's what I think it's one of the most important things because, you know, you are the one that's going to take the action that's going to achieve your goals. You know, you have to, you have to do it. So don't give up on you. There'll be challenges. There'll be obstacles. There'll be things to overcome along the way to any goal. Believe in yourself and your efforts. Um, you're probably going to make mistakes. I, I know I make plenty of them. But mistakes happen. You just learn from them. Still believe in you and your ability. You don't have to be perfect or even better than somebody else. Just believe in yourself. You be you and simply keep trying. It's simple. You just keep moving forward. You keep doing what you have to do. And and, and when you do that, you're capable of excellent and great and, and big things. If you've ever learned a new skill, then you can learn. If you've ever improved in anything that you've ever done, then you can make improvements. You're not perfect. None of us are. But don't give up on you or reaching your goals. And as long as you have some ability to learn, some ability to improve, you know, and, and I believe just about everybody in some capacity you know, has those two things, then, then you can make yourself better. Then you can improve in the areas that you need to. Then you can do things in the future by working toward them that you can't do now. So when I say don't give up on you, it's not saying that you have to believe that you can do everything right now. It's believing that you have the potential and the power and the possibility to improve and learn and develop in the areas and skills that you need in order to accomplish your goals. See, you're the one that needs to achieve your goals. You know, it's you that's going to take the action that's going to make the progress. So you need you. So you might as well treat yourself well. You know, believe that through hard work and persistence and learning and improvement, you can make the changes necessary and do the work to make the progress to achieve your goals. You can achieve great things. Now, when I say believe in yourself, you know, and, and that you can do all these great things, I'm not just blowing a bunch of sunshine. This, it's, it's true that when you work hard, when you persist, when you give it your best, your best can improve. You can learn and develop new things that you'll be able to do in the future that you can't do now. So here's a little example, you know, for me. Do you think that I believe right now I can do all the things that I need to do in order to accomplish my goal right now with my current ability and, and, and state and, and skills? 
Well, I don't. I believe, I believe wholeheartedly that I have the ability to improve and that if I keep working at it, I'll, I'll hone my skills and I'll improve myself and then I'll be able to achieve my goals. So be- believe in your potential because, you know, we're, we're humans, you know, we can, we can develop and learn and adapt and improve and change. We can do all these things. So when I say don't give up on you, don't give up on you and your ability to do the things necessary to become the person that has achieved your goals. Because you don't want to sell yourself short. Do not. You know, it's, it's possible to do the work you know, and reap the benefits, you know, and then and that's awesome. You know, because the one requirement of achieving goals is doing the work. And, and if, as long as that's possible, possible, then don't sell yourself short. You know, this is your life. This is your future. You know, it's your goals. It's what you make of it. If you really want to be miserable and give up and resign yourself to a life that's just mediocre of something that you really don't care for, then go for it. That's your choice. I can't stop you and I really won't try. Now, on the other hand, on the other hand, if you have some goals, if you have some things that you want to accomplish, if that simple thought of doing something that you truly enjoy, that's meaningful and that's valuable to you, if you have that thought at all, then go for it. Don't sell yourself short. This is your life. You can make the possibilities of your future come true. Do the work. Experience the benefits. Conquer your goals and enjoy your life. So when you need to, remind yourself of the progress that you've made. Remind yourself of of the actions that you're taking and the potential that you have, what you're working toward. Remind yourself of these things to help keep your mindset on track, moving forward and confident in your ability to do what's necessary in order to achieve your goals. Well, thank you for listening to the Eat Your Elephant podcast. Hope you enjoy it. Hope you take action and do some of these things to conquer your goals. And thank you for taking the, the short little survey at nickmazy.com slash survey. I really appreciate it. Take care. I'll talk to you again soon.